Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Torchlight. I'm going to be starting a new game here today. It's a little bit old, older. came out in 2009, October 27th, 2009. But since then, there's been two additional games. So if this goes well, we might play through all three and see what they have to offer. The first one I started, I played a little bit back in 2015. Never finished it, so I think this is a good opportunity for you and I to play through it and see what great action awaits us in this RPG game. So let's go ahead and hop on in and create ourselves a new character. And you can do the Destroyer, which is kind of a, a barbarian class. The Vanquisher, Vanquisher, which is the range class. Class, I cannot speak today. And the Alchemist, who kind of um, is your mage class as well. I think I'm going to go with the Barbarian, the Destroyer. We're going to have a dog, and let's name our dog uh, Scrubs. Because we are going to name our main character Tooth. So we got Tooth and Scrubs, and we're going to go ahead and hop on into our adventure. Oh, uh, we'll do normal. All right. Hold control and click the skill or item link in I your... Didn't read all that. I have roamed these lands for as long as I can remember, but my blade... When I heard of the evils befalling Torchlight, I returned from the wilderness. Tales of madness, townsfolk slain or missing, and a darkness rising from the deep. It was inevitable that I was drawn to this place. My blades would not be still. So I made the long journey. I arrived at sunset, and while things at first seemed simple, I did not know then the shadows I would face and the terrible power gathering far below the surface. I would discover them in time. All right, so here we are. Welcome to the town of Torchlight. Explore the area by left clicking to move around. Visit the denizens of the town to shop or to find quests to perform. When you are ready, enter the mines to begin your journey. All right, so here we are, Tooth and Scrubs. Looks like, can we go back this way? Nope. So we are in the town, and I'm assuming Vasmin has our first quest. These monster attacks are disrupting my work. I am Vasmin, a scholar of Ember. I have traveled to Torchlight to study the vast supply of Ember below, but these creatures make it impossible to attain the samples I need. Perhaps you have more courage than these miners. If you brave the tunnels and bring me a sample of gleaming ember, I will reward you well. It should not be difficult. Look for the ember on the first floor. All right, we will take that quest. New quest, the gleaming ember. Looks like we got a cart over here and a, a Durin, the transmuter. I cannot concentrate with these monsters about. If you have items to combine, you will have to come back another time. So, okay, he must be later on. Enchants items, gem seller. So this must be kind of the market area we're in now. What do we have here? Shared stash. Uh, this is your inventory screen. Drag weapons and armor into the appropriate slots to equip them. Drop items by dragging them into the play area. Usable items may be activated by right clicking on them. To use items on your pet, drag them to the pet bowl icon uh, on the top left of the screen or hold shift while right clicking them. This is your shared stash. Place it items here, makes it accessible. Other characters you have created. Oh, okay. So if we wanted to create another character, let's say we wanted to become a vanquisher, then we could share items between the two. That that's pretty cool. Nice little feature they got there. Alright. Looks like we got a dead troll right here. Shame. This uh sells general goods. So we're just exploring the market now. Uh, for being, what, 12-year-old graphics? The graphics are pretty good. I like that. Another dead troll there. Looks like uh, some sort of respawn portal over there. I see a bridge. Let's go see what this bridge has to offer. Fishing shop. I think it said somewhere you can fish to relax during the game if you wanted to. Cemetery over here. I'm guessing at some point we'll be back to see the beautiful cemetery. So let me know in the comments if you've played Torchlight or Torchlight 2 or Torchlight 3 and what you have uh, thought of them or think of them so far. Uh, like I said, I played a little bit a long time ago and for whatever reason I just never finished and now I now I want to come back and do that. Oops, looks like we got a fight up here. Uh, let's help this guy out. 
And we killed some people, and Over this here. is a vanquisher. Can't hold them back much longer. You all right, Syl? Rest here a while. I'm going ahead to finish the job. Okay. So he's chasing down the bad guys, and I'm guessing we're going to talk to Syl. Is that her name? Sent for my help. The ember mines are overrun with these creatures. His letter was urgent, but I had no idea how dire things had become. I am Syl, and that was my companion, Brink. We've only just arrived in Torchlight, and it looks like we're going to need some help. You look capable, and I can pay you well. Please, catch up to Brink before he gets himself killed. Alright, so this looks like to be the main quest. So we've got all three characters together that you could choose from. And for some reason they're here for, what was the guy's name, Master Ulrich? And they're chasing him down or trying to help him out. So let's head into the mines and see what we can do. we got to catch up to Brink before he hurts himself. That was the uh, alchemist. I in Torchlight and began my exploration of the tunnels below. These mines are vast and aglow with ember. I've never seen so rich a vein. Miners labor to extract it and take no heed of my warnings. I cannot blame them. I too could not resist the pull of ember. This ember is the same as that which afflicts me. The taint within it resonates with the corruption in my bones. I can feel it so clearly now. Blight springs from the depths and flows up through the veins. To purge myself of this evil, I must find the source. Alright, so Master Alex has got something going on. Some sort of curse. I'm guessing we'll be helping him with that. Let's go see if we can rescue Brink. Alright, and into the main game. Ooh, some spiders. Let's go ahead and hack and slash some of these spiders away. Uh, looks like I keep clicking to attack these guys. And I think if I right click... It's kind of my AOE attack. And we got a leather vest. Let's see. Um, armor 3. Oh, it already put it on. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. Just a broken bridge. Down the path we go. Oops, some more spiders. And swat smash. Smash that barrel there and get ourselves 10 gold. Kill another spider here. Beautiful. And what do we got? Ratlins. And there we go. I can AOE them and knock them out pretty easily. Open this door here. And some more ratlins to kill. Slash, slash. Break another barrel. Very dreary bridge to cross. Let's see. Let's go over and get these ratlins here. That one went bye bye. We'll get him. He kind of ran away. And uh, level 10 miner. Okay, let's talk to him. Hello. In my time off, I do a spot of cave fishing down here. You'd be surprised at the variety of fish in these underground pools. Okay, good to know. Let's see what these chests have for us. Doll blade, leather helm, and leather cap. All right, are any of those worth to us? Uh, requires level two, requires level two, so we won't be using that. And now we've got dual wielding doll blades. All right, let's go ahead and break this barrel. Some gold and a health potion. Go get this spider here. And we just obliterated that spider. Look at that big old pile of... Uh, Red goo there. Back around here. Uh, do we buy a fishing pole from him or anything? Let's see. Uh, uh, Ember, you can see it gleaming everywhere. I'll make a fortune. Okay. No help from him. Nice pile of bones right there. Anything over here? Nope. Okay. Back this way we go. More barrels to smashy smashy. Smash this one. Oops, that one exploded. Okay, let's not do that again. Crush him. We do get the gold, though. That's nice. Ooh, a fork in the road. Uh, let's go take care of all these spiders. And we'll do our AoE on a couple of them. Got those guys. A rattlin. Smashed him. A couple more spiders to crush. All right. Ooh, this is glowing. Gleaming Ember. All right, that's the quest item we needed. You have completed a quest. To receive your reward, travel back to the town and speak to the individual with the question mark above their head. Use a town portal scroll to return directly to Torchlight. Alright, well we're not quite ready yet. Let's knock out this Rattlin. Get that gold there. Smash some more boxes. Small cannon. I'm assuming that's a, a pistol of sorts. Yes. Well, I don't think we can use pistols because we are not the 
range class. Let's go ahead and take care of these Ratlins. All right, so this is where we already came through. And back this way we go. A couple more Ratlins to smashy smashy. And there they go. And let's continue on down this path. Barrel to smash, and it didn't blow up, but there is a skeleton underneath, was a skeleton underneath it. Couple more Ratlins. Critical strike. And into a fine powder they explode. AoE attack those guys. Another Ratlin. Some more gold for us to loot. Make sure we can buy stuff when we get back to the surface. Like in the game so far. Again, I didn't get, ooh, a plunger. Kaboom. Oops, that was, um... Uh, if you get a level, click on the stats up and skills up. Okay, so we'll deal that after we deal with all these guys. More AoEs, more AoEs, and down they all go. Alright, so it was... What was our stats? Is it I? Um, here we go. Alright, you have new stat points to distribute. Click the button next to each attribute to improve that aspect of your character. You also have new skill points that may be used to improve your character's abilities in the skill menu. All right, so Tooth, we're unrecognized. That's kind of sad, but whatever. Uh, got, what is that, 5,000 XP, but no fame, 360 hit points, and mana pool of 25. Our strength is level 10, dexterity 4, magic 3, defense 10. Uh, and we don't have any resistances yet, but we got five skill points, so let's go ahead and add. Um, so dexterity increases range damage, so we're not really doing range, and we're not really doing a magic. So let's do two into defense and two into strength. Or three into strength, excuse me, there we go. All right, so then let's go ahead and pick our trait. So I can improve our slash attack. Uh, dual wielding, improves damage of all weapons when dual wielding. Hmm, I think I want to be a dual wielder, so we'll probably get this one. Uh, let's go ahead and check Titan. Soul Rend. A powerful phantasmal blade cleaves your foes. Or we could do Shadow Armor. Summons a fantan phantasma which attacks nearby foes. Let's go ahead and get dual wielding. There we go. So 6% damage bonus when dual wielding. Always enable 12% damage bonus when dual wielding. So that's the next level. All right. So I like that. We'll go ahead and clear that out. Let's take care of this spider here. And I think that's everything. We'll go back down that path we exploded. Did, did, did. Take out these ratlins here first. A little more gold. Stairs down. Okay, so this is the way down. We don't want to do that yet. We need to go find Brink. So let's go find him. Smash this barrel here. Nothing. Uh, a chest. Ooh, a lot of gold. And Dusty Staff, uh, you've discovered a magical item. It is unidentified, which means that its magical powers are undiscovered. Identify it by right-clicking and identify scroll, and then left-clicking on the item. All right, and identify scroll, leather belt, and another identify scroll. So let's go and pull up our inventory. So we are level two now, so we can put a leather helmet on, get a little more protection there. And let's just check out... All right, Simple Hatchet does 29 damage per second. Physical damage 10 to 19, average attack speed. Does that beat the Dull Blade? Nope, but it does beat the Rusty Blade. So which one's the Rusty? Is it this one? That's Dull, so this is Rusty. So let's go ahead and switch those out. And Rusty Blade, so those are two Rusty Blades. Um, and we can go ahead and identify, right click to use the scroll, and then left click or excuse me, this, and let's just go ahead and look at that leather belt. So three armor plus two mana. So we can go ahead and equip that leather belt and get ourselves a bonus there. All right, tooth is looking pretty good. Uh, let's, can we look at scrubs? This is your pet's inventory. Your pet can carry as many items as you can. You can also have your pet pick up items directly on the ground by holding shift and clicking on them. Your pet can also equip a limited selection of items to improve their abilities. So looks like pets can have rings, amulets, and a ring again. Uh, looks like they could also learn some spells. And okay, so we haven't done anything there yet, so we can go ahead and close that out. All right, so we need to go find Brink. Did we miss him over here somewhere? Let's run back this way. Oop, a wobbly hatchet. We'll pick that up because we can probably sell that later. Um, so let's go ahead and head down this left plat. Oops, 
blew blew ourselves up there. Oh, we already did all this. Maybe we need to go down a level. All right, so let's just head back to the stairs and head down a level. Maybe he already went down. Take the long way around. Tooth is getting tooth and scrubs are getting their steps in, so that's a good sign. Got to lose a little weight. If you've been enjoying this content, please don't forget to like the video. Comment on down below again on what you think of Torchlight. And if you've really been enjoying it, subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in orderly fashion. All right, we are on the second floor of the mines. And let's see if we can find Brink here. Found some Ratlins. Knocked those guys out. And we got ourselves a, a big old troll here. So let's get rid of him. Let's see if we can flank him a little bit. We're going to run around, run, run, run. Okay, so he just turned around. Ooh, he hits pretty strong. That's all right, we hit stronger. So there, down goes that troll. Got all the loot there. Our health is doing pretty good so far. End of the bridge there, and we'll continue this way as well. See some gold, some more spiders. Let's take care of these spiders. Crash and burn all of them. Some leather boots. Open this door. Continue on down our path. Some more ratlins. So, so far we've killed, what, a skeleton, a bunch of ratlins, spiders, and a troll. And we still haven't found Brink. These Varklin, wait, what was that? Uh, Varklin, we'll just say that. Um, we killed some of those as well. Yeah, I see some jellies? Some gels, okay. So, quite a range of enemies so far. Let's go ahead and get this gel here. Got that one. Smash him. Smash these guys here. Come back here, friends. All right, let's get rid of these two, and we'll take care of this one. Smashy, smashy, and away they go. Loot that pistol. Keep working our way down here. All right, there you go. That's an exploding barrel. Don't want to mess with that. Uh, ooh, that gel just shocked us. Uh, how are we doing on health? Eh, we're still doing good on health. No need to take a health potion just quite yet. Get rid of those guys. Get these gels. Take him and him. Oof, that shock is uh, kind of rough. Got to get that one as quick as you can, huh? All right, and these guys. Down he goes. Someone's mining down there. Pile of gold. Let's go over here. Knock out these guys, a little AoE attack. And is there anything? Let's smash this barrel, nothing. All right, back this way we go. Brink, where are you, my friend? We need to find you and save you. Because that's what, what was her name, Syl? That's what Syl wants us to do. Come out, come out wherever you are. Another Rattlin. All right, a bunch of gels. All right, let's AoE these guys. And down they go. All right, ooh, they do give a lot of gold. Spiders. All right, uh, identify scroll we'll take. Open another door. And down the tunnels we head. Another troll for us to deal with. Let's take care of him as quickly as we can. There's Brink behind the troll. All right, so down goes the troll. Let's go help him with these ratlins. And down the ratlins go. All right, Brink, we are here to rescue you. Send you after me? She must have thought I was in over my head again. Well, she's right. These monsters are getting stronger, and I could use your help. I'm going after the fiend that was attacking Sill on the bridge. Will you join me? Of course we will join you, Brink. That's what we're here for. All right, Brink has found, and he has joined our party. So we got ourselves a nice group of two. Go take out this spider here. And what's over here? Okay, let's check out that other corner before we continue on down into the Orden Mines. We killed that troll. Break that barrel. Let's get rid of these guys here. Oops, level three. We are just climbing the ladder. Smash this barrel here. Brink is running into combat. Good for him. Another plunger. Let's see, plunge those. And down they go. Ooh, a lot of gold. Oops, and some ratlins coming out. It's like they were trapping us. A lot of AoEs going off here. Let's get rid of these guys. Blocked. The last one. There we go. 
some mantles, some more helmets. All right, let's take a peek at our inventory here. Um, all right, Wobbly Hatchet does 28, so that's not going to replace anything. It does take two runes, so when we get some runes here, we'll be able to attach some of those. Let's see, leather boots, uh, two armor, two armor. The belt's not any better, and the helmet is the same. All right, so we're not going to do that. Let's go ahead and level up again. Let's take... Um, let's take another. We got five points, so we'll take three and two. So we are getting very strong now. And then for our skill, let's do, do we want soul rend or do we want shadow armor? 29 second summon duration, 4% increase chance to block. Fix 120% of weapage DPS, plus 37 electric damage and 50. Okay, let's go ahead and take soul rend and we're gonna put that no, I don't want to do that. Hold on. All right. So this is going to be left click. And then let's have this be soul rend. So six is soul rend. All right. So let's just see what six does. Nice. Okay. So it's a nice large attack. Powerful and it cleaves your foes. Um, all right. So we'll just have to remember to use that from time to time. Grab that mana potion there. Let's head back towards that bridge of Brink and Tooth and Scrubs and keep exploring these mines. All right, some more Ratlins to take care of. Let's go ahead and use this new skill and boom, down they go. That's a nice little skill, glad we got that. So we got a good AoE, we got a good strong single attack. And then obviously we got our regular old attack here. Okay, let's get all the loot. Ash and Scepter, Mana Potion, and we missing anything else? Nope, all right, down the hallway. Break some of these barrels, hopefully they don't go boom on us. Kill another skeleton, another barrel. Ooh, we got a, quite a few guys over here. So let's get our AoEs and some of these bigger skills going. And down they all go. Brink, you're helping us out, my friend. Thank you so much. Town Portal Scroll, Leather Mantle. Weapons rack, okay. Survey says, practice bow. All right, we'll have to sell that eventually. Over here, all right, down the path. And another ratlin down. All right, more ratlins to smite. Plenty of spiders, get rid of those. Some gold. Brink stealing all the glory. Gotta save some for us, friend. Health potion. All right, down he goes. Uh-oh, looks like the first boss here, uh, a mage. Oh, did we get him or did he fly away? All right, power skill, AOE, nice. Smashy, smashy. Bunch of gold there. So, okay, so that wasn't a mini boss. That was just a, a stronger, stronger enemy there. Down he goes. Down all they go. And up over here. Oops, let's get rid of him. I see a table and we got a troll over here. Knocks back foes. Show him who's boss. And boom, ooh, that does take a lot of mana. Okay, so we gotta be careful on that. All right, let's go take care of these ratlins and then we'll come back and see what that table has to offer. All right, let's go back this way, Brink. Come on, friend. All right, Foreman's table. Survey says, identify scroll. We will take it. Uh, you have found a spell scroll. In the spells tab of your inventory, you can right click to, on the scroll or drop it in one of your spell slots to learn it. And you'll gain a new ability. You can also teach your pet spells by dropping them in their appropriate inventory slots. So let's see what we got. All right, spells. Heal all. Um, can we, let's see if we can teach, um, Scrubs it. All right, you have inscribed a new spell in your spell book. You may now cast it as you would any other skill. Skills and spells can be mapped to the quick slots. All right, so he knows heal all. So let's see if he'll be able to use that. I guess uh, he doesn't really have any magic. Yeah, we'll find out if that was a good or a bad move. So back down the tunnel we go, everyone in tow. I think he used it. 
His mana's slowly regaining. Okay, explodey barrel. We're going to avoid that. Let's go get rid of these ratlins here. And down they go. Some more friends over here. See, now if we had arranged, we could do that. And just knock out a bunch of folk without hurting ourselves. So we got a Ratlin Foreman, another level two enemy. So we're starting to move up the line of enemies. Let's get some AoEs going off in here. Uh, your mana is low. Okay, so we could use mana potions. Blah, 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 blah. All right, Town Portal Scroll, Health Potion. Anything over here? Nope, we're good. So let's go ahead and smash through these barrels. Take out that skeleton, smash through this barrel, no skeleton. Is a pile of gold we will take. Spiders go away. Some stuff collapsing from the ceiling, and there are the stairs down. All right, Brink, you can take care of that spider for us. Let's head back and we'll open that door. Now we know how to get down to the next level. Swing around this way. Now let's see what's on the other side, a door number two. Other than a bunch of enemies, let's go uh, meet them face to face. I see two trolls and quite a few enemies. Are we like in a, a right breaker, the malignant? Okay, so we are in the, uh, looks like the harder area. Gonna drink ourselves a mana potion. Soloing this guy, health wise we're doing fine still. So let's just start slashing away. All right, level up, level four. Let's go take care of this other troll. All right, so they all go down. So I guess these doors must separate from the the harder areas. If you guys know, comment on down below and let me... Uh, my inventory's full. Okay, so let's go ahead and give Scrub some stuff to carry here. Because, uh, was it Shift? Yeah, so he can carry some of the stuff we're not going to use. That way I can carry some more stuff. And there we go. All right, Ash and Scepter, Health Potion, Spear... All right, let's take a peek at that spear there. Ashen Scepter Spear, it's two-handed, but we want to stay dual wielding. Anyways, like I was saying, down in the comments, if going through these doors is like the the hard mode or like the, the bonus level of the episode, let me know. All right, plunger, blow that up. See if some guys come out of that shoot. Nope, but we will take all the gold back here, though. All the gold and what's in the chest. Health potion and leather tunic. And let's go ahead and identify it. Identify. All right, so we will go ahead and swap out for that. And we'll put that there. Oops, how could we skip that pile of gold back there? How dare we? And what do we got here? Leather boots, we'll go ahead and pick those up so we can sell those eventually. And we will go ahead and swing all the way around down back to that ladder. So I think we'll go ahead and end the episode there. Thank you guys so much for coming out and joining me today in Torchlight. Like the video if you've enjoyed the content. Comment on down below on uh, what you think of Torchlight. If you've played, if you haven't played. Again, for being a 12-year-old game, I enjoy it so far. I mean, we've only done two levels of the dungeon, but whatever. It's pretty cool. Uh, if you really have enjoyed it and you'd like to do me a favor, go ahead and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time in an orderly fashion. Thank you so much for joining me today, and we'll see you in the next Torchlight video.